Hello, this is Mary with All Things Automotive, bringing you here today a 2020 Toyota 4Runner SR5. This vehicle features a 4-liter V6 engine with 4-wheel drive. There have been no accidents or damages reported to Carfax, and this is a Carfax certified one-owner vehicle. As we get closer to the front of the vehicle, you'll be able to see that it is a brilliant bright white clear coat with chroma black accents as you'll be able to see there on the grille and down around those fog lights. Those fog lights will help you out in inclement weather and speaking of inclement weather, we'll come along here to these sides and take a look at your tires and your wheels. This vehicle features black 18 inch XC series wheels and as for your tire treads, you have a lot of life left in them, but I'll get you those exact measurements in just a second as this vehicle, along with all the other vehicles here at All Things Automotive, has undergone a new multi-point inspection as well as received a fresh oil change, a new engine air filter, and a new cabin air filter. So you don't need to worry about replacing any of those anytime soon. One more thing I would like to mention before we go into the vehicle is up there at the top, you do have silver and black roof rails if you ever wanted to transport anything up there. We'll now take a look to the inside of the vehicle. Here on the inside of the vehicle, you'll be able to see you do have some lovely black and graphite colored cloth upholstery. And I'll just take a look in the glove box and bring out the results of that multi-point inspection that I was talking about. As you'll be able to see on here, you've got green checks the whole way around. And as for your tire treads, you have 18 30 seconds in all of your tires. And as for your brake pads, you have 9 30 seconds in the front and 8 30 seconds in the rear. So you've got a good ways to go before you need to replace any of those wearables. This vehicle also comes with an owner's manual, so if you have any questions, you'll be able to look them up in there. We'll now come along to the rear occupant seating of this vehicle. Here in the rear occupant seating, you'll be able to notice that lovely cloth upholstery is back here as well. This vehicle can seat a total of seven people and it does have three rows of seatings. And in this row in particular, if you have two people sitting here instead of three, this middle seat does fold down to become an additional armrest with two cup holders. Also back here in the center, you do have power outlets to charge your mobile devices, pockets on the back of those front seats for these rear occupants, as well as all other floor mats and all of the seating positions to help keep your floors nice and clean. We'll look over here on the door. On all of the doors, you do have cup holders in them as well as powered windows. I will now make our way around to the rear of the vehicle. Here on the rear, you might already notice you do have a tow bar pre-installed if you ever wanted to hook up a small trailer or a bike rack. And you do have a rear backup camera to help you whenever you're going in reverse or parking. I'll just pop up this tailgate. And as you'll be able to see, you do not have much room back here because of that third row seatings, but these seats do fold down to give you a lot more room. So I'll show you what they look like folded down in just a second. All right, now with those seats down, you'll be able to see you have a lot of space back here to haul some pretty significant items. I'd also like to point out this all-weather floor mat back here. If you keep those third row seats folded down and only need to transport five people, you can keep this liner in to help keep your trunk space very nice and clean. I'd also like to mention that you do have cup holders back here for those rear occupants as well as a charging outlet. And that those seats in front do have top and bottom anchor tether points if you have little ones who need car seats. I'll just put this tailgate down and we'll move around to the driver's side. I would like to mention that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get two keys for your convenience to prevent you from ever getting locked out. This vehicle does come with powered windows and mirrors as well as powered door locks. And as for your seating adjustments, this vehicle does come with eight way power seating adjustments. So you can move your seat forwards, backwards, up, down, tilting the seat forward and back, and then two directional lumbar support. You also have a telescopic steering wheel, meaning you can push it in and out as well as up and down to make sure it fits you as you need. And then to the left of the steering wheel is your dashboard backlight controls. I'll now just get in the vehicle and turn it on for you. All right, now that the engine's running and the dashboard's lit up, you'll be able to see this vehicle has about 32,560 miles on it. We'll take our attention over here to the right side of the steering wheel because over here you do have your dashboard navigation buttons. So with these, you'll be able to cycle through all of the information and services this vehicle provides. And right underneath that, you do have your lane keep assist buttons. And to the left side of the steering wheel, you do have your volume controls as well as your Bluetooth and call controls as this vehicle does have smartphone integration. Well, now take a look over here to the center of the vehicle. Here in the center, you do have your lovely LCD touchscreen display. And I'll just throw this vehicle in reverse to show you that backup camera in action. In addition, you do have built-in navigation system with this vehicle as well. To the left and right, you do have your radio controls as well as your menu buttons. 
a bit farther down, you do have your climate control settings. Farther down still, you do have a USB charging port and power outlet for your mobile devices, as well as a small compartment to put something like your phone. In the center here, you do have two cup holders, as well as a small storage compartment here, your four wheel drive shift, your main gear shift, and then that back window does open and close with this button. You do have your main storage compartment here with a removable divider. And you also have a power outlet here as well. We'll now move on to the last section of this video. In the last section of this video, we do want to address that this vehicle is pre-owned. So we'll be looking around for any blemishes, nicks, or stains. We know a lot of our customers come from very far away. And so we want to make the purchasing process as straightforward and transparent as we possibly can. We want you to know exactly what you're getting with the purchase of this vehicle, imperfections and all. So as you look around here on the inside, I am able to notice a few small stains on the ceiling. You do have a faint odor inside. And on the dashboard when I had turned it on, it did have a fairly noticeable scratch on it, but it was there. And lastly, here on the rear driver's side door, you do have a few scratches. But other than those, there is nothing else really standing out to me. So we'll move along to the outside of the vehicle. Here on the outside, we'll be looking up and down, again, for any of those imperfections. You do have a few small scratches here and nicks along the base of the driver's side. We'll move along to the front. You do have several nicks here along the front. Most likely from a few stone chips. Stone chipping is extremely common. The only way you can really prevent it is just by not driving your vehicle. This is also a white vehicle, which is a lighter color and lighter colors do tend to show more than darker colors might. We'll move along here to the passenger side. Again, looking up and down, you do have several small scratches there on the rear passenger side door. And we'll move along here to the back now. Typically where there are several scratches and nicks on vehicles is where the tailgate meets the bumper as people don't take care of putting items in and taking items out. And that is the case for this vehicle. You do have two good scratches there. And as I look around, there are some very faint other ones. And I'll close the tailgate. And we'll continue back around. We're here back to where we started. So that generally concludes this video vehicle tour. This vehicle has a lot of great features to offer. If you're interested in a white mid-size SUV with the ability to seat seven, fold down seats with all weather floor mats, silver roof rails with a built-in tow bar, built-in navigation, with lane keep assist and four wheel drive, this is a good option for you. If you're interested in this vehicle, come and check it out at All Things Automotive, located at 21518 Great Cove Road, McConnellsburg, PA. Or you can give us a call at 717-485-4224. You can also check out this four door wagon and other listings on our website at www.allthingsautomotive.com. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day.